By 2021, self-driving cars will have hit almost 100 billion miles. Think about the cars of the future for a second. They are gonna be amazing. Supercomputers on wheels with deep learning, LiDAR, radar, camera technology, thermal technology. It will be nothing like we see today. And this will have profound implications on the types of services that will be available. You'll be able to push a button and a self-driving car will show up. It will take you from point A to point B. But the implications on the economics of number of sales for vehicles for the auto industry, the profitability for the auto industry will be important and there's gonna be winners and losers. If you're not driving it, do you need to own it? Now, it's not just the auto industry that will be impacted. This touches a lot of different industries, in particular cities and smart cities, because great cities around the world will want to have self-driving technology to bring in the talent, the infrastructure, the people to come to their cities. Moreover, another industry is healthcare. We spend over $400 billion a year on healthcare costs due to accidents. Now, if a car can't crash or the probability of it crashes drops significantly, we can save billions and billions of dollars of healthcare costs. Self-driving cars will also have a profound implication for the insurance market. And with me today is my great partner in crime here, Joe Schneider, who leads our uh, insurance group for corporate finance. So Joe, if a car can't crash, or at least the probability of a car crashing is going to decline significantly, that's got to have an important implications for the insurance market. It does. It has huge implications for the insurance market. I mean, the way we think about it is that from now till roughly 2050, there could be a 90% decline in accidents. And so the less accidents we have on the road, the lower really the amount of losses that insurers will have. And, and we as sort of consumers or as companies buying coverage for our commercial fleets will think, okay, if there's less risk, we should be paying less premium. But the other piece that we see is that product liability will become a bigger and bigger piece of this pie. Because now we're talking about ensuring the technology and algorithm and sensors thing. exactly that are gonna be operating these vehicles more and more than they are today. So as an insurer, that has profound implications for, for the business. As we think about the chaotic middle, this interplay between robots and humans, so to speak, over the next five to 10 years, insurance companies are really gonna be required to think about pricing risk creatively and flexibly. Because you think about the last 100 years, it's been people. And now there we have this dynamic interplay. Should be quite an interesting future, to say the least. Now, this will also have profound implications if you think about it for the energy market. And we've talked to Regina Mayer, who's the sector head of energy for KPMG on this topic. While autonomous vehicles, and in particular electric vehicles, will have an impact on gasoline demand, we don't see the peak happening until 2040. And even then we anticipate that the tail off in demand is relatively gradual. Our power and utilities clients and our oil and gas clients are both gearing up for it, but in different ways. Both believe that they will be the charger of the future. The oil and gas companies are investing in charging stations and that infrastructure, but the utilities believe that's gonna be their market going forward. I've even talked to some of our more forward-thinking utility executives that envision infrastructure itself being a charger. Imagine the road being conductive and being able to charge your vehicle while you're driving. Those are the kinds of innovations in technology that will be game-changing and will drive the uptake of autonomous vehicles and electric vehicles of tomorrow. Thanks, Regina, and thanks, Joe, for joining me today. That was terrific. Clearly, the implications are profound, and there will be winners and losers, but mark my words, the future is going to be amazing.